my name's Esme. Uh, I'm training up as a bar manager for camera. And um, what makes a champion beer for you? Oh, well, probably quite different to the... not. I like the new beers, the really sort of strong, fruity, American hopped ones or things like that. And uh, what kind of made you want to volunteer for camera? Uh, at this, normally I volunteer occasionally just for the odd night or something because it's quite fun working on the bar and you get a few pints of free beer. So, And um, this time, though, I wanted to learn about the bar managing and I've been learning about the cooling systems, and which is quite an interesting thing. It's the, the first time they've used this system at this festival, so it's... Uh, yeah, so it's been interesting. I'm learning, basically. And uh, I guess, what what do you think makes British beer so unique that like invites so many people here? Because I'll I'll give you an example. Like we talked to a guy from Japan who flew six thousand miles yeah. just for this festival. So, what wow. about that? What, do, do, what, things like that? Like I thought, I thought most of the people here were local. To be honest, <laughs> I didn't know people came that far. So I really can't say. I've maybe that you have so many beers in one room. The prices are good, you know, there's not many places in London that you're paying 3 20 a pint anymore. So, and that there's just so many, like, you're not going to run out of choice, are you? And uh, I guess my final question is, uh, why do we need events like this to, like, display craft culture? Well, again, it gets a lot of beers in the same place. They are, they're sort of kept to the right quality sometimes like some pubs don't always keep them to their best like here they are kept at their best quality so it sort of shows them i guess it showcases them yeah